Welcome to the class. Myself Ashwini, lecturer in statistics. And our today's topic is in index number test for adequacy of index number. Test for adequacy of index number. We are taking some tests because in index number we are having so many formulas and many formulas give different answers. So that we have some tests. We have four tests in uh, index number that is unit test, time reversal test, factor reversal test and circular test. And this unit test says it requires that the index number should be independent of the units in which price or quantities of various commodities are quoted. That is whatever we take whether it is a price or a quantity will not consider the units so that we can use this unit, unit test and this test satisfied by all index number formula we have discussed above that is Lapris, Pashis, Dervish Bole, Fishers and Marshall Edwards but it will not satisfy simple aggregative price index number that is unit test will not satisfies or it will accept the formula of simple aggregative price index number except this it will satisfy all other five formulas or a methods that is Lapris, Pashis, Marshall Edwards, Dabish Poli and Fisher's index numbers. And the next test is time reversal test that is TRT. Time reversal test is nothing but TRT. And this test was proposed by Professor Irwin Fisher is a mathematician actually. According to him, an index number should be such that when base year and current year are interchanged, the resulting index number should be the reciprocal of the earlier. That is, if that uh, base year index number, base year, here we will consider price, uh, price index number only. If we talk about in index number, always we will take only price year, price index number. So, if the base year index number that is P01, it is base year index number, it should be such that uh, when the base year and the current year are interchanged and here the time, time, this 0 is base year and 1 is current year, if we reverse this, that is P10, I will just interchange the time, uh, that is we will take the current year as base and base year as current year, then it should be interchanged, the resulting index number should be the reciprocal of the earlier, that is if I consider this as P01 as base year, this should be the reciprocal of and this should be equal to the reciprocal of P10. That is P01, it should be equal to the reciprocal of the earlier or we can rewrite this as P10 uh, is equal to P01. If I take the cross multiplication, that is P01 into P10 should be equal to 1. And this is the condition for time reversal test. And time reversal test requires that the index number computed backward should be the reciprocal of the index number computed forward. That is, this is the backward. This is backward. And this is forward. Next current year. That is the product of backward and the uh, forward index numbers. And this condition is written like this. And this time reversal test uh, should uh, uh, or the or male ratios they should not be expressed as percentage because here we have considered capital P. Capital P is nothing but price relative. While we are calculating price relative already we have multiplied by 100 so that we will not consider here, here we will not take the percentage that is we will not multiply by 100. And this TRT formula or a time reversal test uh, it will not satisfy and it will not hold good for Lapris, 
Pashis and Dabish Bole index numbers. It will not satisfy for Lapris, Pashis and Dabish Bole, but it's satisfied by Marshall Edward and Fishers and Kelly's also. It will not satisfy by Lapris, Pashis and Dabish Bole and it will satisfy by Marshall Edward, Fishers and Kelly's price index numbers. In examination, you may get this type of question. Prove that or show that uh, time reversal test satisfy uh, time reversal test satisfies Marshall Edward and Fisher's or Marshall Edward Kelly's or Fisher's Kelly's like this. You will you may get this type of problem to prove for five marks in examination. So that today in this class we will sat we will see the how it will satisfy and why it will not satisfy. Okay. First, we will go through the Lapris method. Lapris method. First, I will write the formula for Lapris index number with P01 of L is equal to, we know that summation of P1 Q0 divided by summation of P1, P0 Q0 into 100. This is the standard formula we are using for Lapris. Here in this formula, I will interchange 0 and 1 or I will reverse the time. Instead of 0, I will take 1 and instead of 1, I will take 0. So that after reversing this, I will write this, I will rewrite this formula as Instead of P1, I will write P0 and 1 should be interchanged by 0 and 0 should be interchanged by 1. So that it is P1 Q0 should be written as P0 Q1 and here both are in 0 that is I will write P1 Q1 into 100. According to TRT that is time reversal test. According to TRT, it should satisfy P01 into P10 should be equal to 1. According to TRT, the product of the forward and the backward index number should be equal to 1. So, I will substitute these two formulas of Lapris in this condition. So, that this is summation of P1 Q0 by summation of P0 Q0 into summation of P0 Q0 by summation of P1 Q1 and here we will not take 100 and this should be equal to 1. Let us prove this. Here P0 Q0, here P0 Q0, it will get cancels. Sorry, this is P0 Q1. See here, in this formula, we cannot cancel anything. Okay, and it, it will remain as it is. So, this is not equal to 0. So, that P01 of L will not satisfy, satisfy TRT. It will not satisfy TRT. And similarly, if we take Pashis, P01 of Pashis is summation of P1 Q1 by summation of P0 Q1 into 100 and again I will uh, interchange the time of Pashis. So, it is P10 of P is equal to instead of 1 we will write 0, instead of 0 we will write 1. Next Substitute this for TRT condition that is P01 into P10 is equal to 1. It is summation of P1 Q1 by summation of P0 Q1 into summation of P0 Q0 by summation of P1 Q0. Here also we will we cannot cancel any number any item so it is not equal to 1. So it will not 
satisfy TRT. That is, our Laplace index number will not satisfy TRT. And the next one is Marshall Edwards. Marshall Edwards, P01 of Marshall Edwards is equal to summation of P1 Q0 plus summation of summation of P1 Q1 divided by summation of P0 Q0 plus summation of P0 Q1. This is for Marshall Edward with 0 and 1 and again I will interchange the year that is time as that is instead of 1 I will take 0 instead of 0 I will take 1 similarly for this instead of P1 and Q1 I will write P0 Q0 and divided by summation of P1 Q1 plus summation of P1 Q0. This is for Marshall Edward. Next, you substitute this condition or a formula for TRT condition. For TRT, it is P01 of Marshall Edward into P01 of Marshall Edward is equal to 1. Substitute these two, that is summation of P1 Q0 plus summation of P1 Q1 divided by summation of P0 Q0 plus summation of P0 Q1 into summation of P0 Q1 plus summation of P0 Q0 divided by summation of P1 Q1 plus summation of P1 Q0. See your your P1 Q0 plus summation of P1 Q1 is in the numerator. See P1 Q0, P1 Q0, P1 Q1, P1 Q1. So that we can cancel this one. And similarly P0 Q0, here we have P0 Q0 and summation P0 Q1 and summation P0 Q1 and this is also can be cancelled and this is equal to 1. So Marshall Edwards satisfy TRT. Here Marshall Edwards satisfies TRT. Next we will go for Darbish Bowley. Next is Darbish Bowley. In Dabish Bowley, we have half of this. Okay, we have half of these two, and this is after reversing the time. Again, you take or you can write or substitute this in TRT condition. So that it is summation of P1 Q0 by summation of P0 Q0 plus summation of P1 Q1 by summation of P0 Q1 into summation of P0 Q1 divided by summation of P1 Q1 plus summation of P0 Q0 summation of P1 Q0 and here we cannot cancel any numerator of the denominators so that we will here this is half half so that this dervish body is not equal to 1 therefore dervish body will not satisfy trt dervish body will not satisfy trt and the Next is yes. 
Next is Fisher's index number. That is P01 of Fisher's is summation of P1 Q0 by summation of P0 Q0 into summation of P1 Q1 by summation of P0 Q1 the square root into 100. Again, I'll uh, reverse the time that is base and base here and the current here that is P10 of Fisher's is summation of P0 Q1 by summation of P1 Q1 into summation of P0 Q0 by summation of P1 Q0 the square root into 100. Now I will substitute this in TRT condition that is P01 of Fisher's into P10 of Fisher's should be equal to 1 so that I will I'll take, I will not consider 100, just I will write the formula inside the square root. That is summation of P1 Q0 by summation of P0 Q0 into summation of P1 Q1 by summation of P0 Q1 into summation of P0 Q1 by summation of P1 Q1 into summation of P0 Q0 by summation of P1 Q0, the whole root should be equal to 1. See here, it is P1 Q0. P1 Q0 is here. I will just cancel this. P1 Q0, P1 Q0 will get cancels. P0 Q0 and here it is P0 Q0 will get cancels. P1 Q1, P1 Q1 get cancels. And P0 Q1, P0 Q0 q1 will get cancels square root of 1 is equal to 1 or 1 is equal to 1 so fisher's index satisfy trt so fisher's index numbers satisfy trt and the last one is our kelly's price index number and last one is kelly's price index number Our Kelly's index number is Kelly's is P01 of Kelly's is summation of P1Q and summation of P0Q. See in Kelly's the quantity will be always constant. In Kelly's quantity will be always constant so that after reversing a time it is summation of P0Q by summation of P1 Q. Take TRT condition that is P01 of Kelly's into P10 of Kelly's should be equal to 1. So summation of P1 Q by summation of P0 Q into summation of P0 Q by summation of P1 Q should be equal to 1. P1 Q1, P1 Q P1Q will get cancelled and P0Q, P0Q get cancelled. So 1 is equal to 1. So Kelly's satisfy TRT. See, in this TRT condition will satisfy the only uh, it will satisfy only Marshall Edwards, Fisher's and uh, Kelly's. But it does not satisfy for Lapis, Pashis and Dobish, Bowley. And this condition further we will use in the, find, uh, use, it will use in problem solving. In that, in exam also, we will get 10 marks problem including Fisher's TRT and FRT conditions. Thank you.